Hello, I'm Kira Pakora, and today I am one of the admins on the Yowie, on of the Yowie Addiction Society on Facebook. Today I'm going to talk about my first anime and manga because it was one of the first mangas I read as well. Kizuna Bonds of Love by Kazuma Kadaka, released in 1996 on VHS, two-part VHS, two VHS tapes. I meant, but it's a Really, really great story, but you have to read the manga before you watch this because the manga has a better storyline. And not even, they even had another OVA come out, and it was, it did not do justice. The ending was fairly sweet in all of them, but it didn't do the series justice itself as an anime. But in the anime, um, it basically goes between, um, K and G O G and Ramaru Sam Samjima, which are actually the main couple, but in the beginning, K discovers he has a, a brother named Kai Sagano who is 19, and um, who's also their who's also um related by their by blood because of their father. They have separate mothers. Um, the the father um. It is a Yakuza boss. I might have just said that, I'm sorry, but anyway. In this in the enemy itself, Romero gets run over by a motorcycle by Kai, which was actually meant for K. And Romero Romero plays the Kendo, which is Japanese sword fighting, if people don't if people never don't know what that is, it's Japanese sword fighting, but they use wooden swords. Um and he is paralyzed and not able to play Kendo again, which is sad. For real, it's sad. Um, the um, the one part I did not like about the anime is they make in the beginning parts and in, in towards middle and end, in certain in in some parts of it even, they make K come out as a like they like people may think he's a jackass, but if you actually understand him. He's actually a pretty good guy and loves Ram Naru so much. But the one, the, what makes him funny is the stuff he says when he's drunk. Yes, he works at a bar. Ram Naru's in college and they are in college. I believe they, I don't know if Kay's in college. They met in college, but I believe, but I know Ram Naru's in college and I'll explain the reason why I know this as well. Um. And it just, like, basically talks about how the relationship and situations happen to them. And as one, in one situation I can talk about as when Ram, about Ram Naru, he, um, was helping out a professor at the, the school college. And, um, they went out, he asked Ram Naru out for a drink. Of course, Ram Naru is old enough to drink. Um, of course he goes. He goes somewhere, and basically, the, the bar knows them, knows him. Basically, he's like the perverted, perf the perverted professor, and uh, he spikes from the roof's drink, tries to have sex with him in the bar, but Kai comes and beats the living crap out of the professor, takes from the roof home. In the book, basically, it's different. I don't know what. Ha basically, I think he just dropped him off, but. In the book, it comes out to a lot more than that. Let's just say, um, uh, there is sexual stuff happening, and Ram Naru doesn't realize it's Kaizen sex with until something happens, but, um, yeah, Kai really, really likes Ram Naru. Except towards, in the manga, he likes Masa, and I think the second manga you will discover this. And in the second OVA you will discover it as well towards the end, but I just wanted to say that even though my my random jibber jabber about the anime, you may not understand me because I have I have a disa mentally disabled mind, but I but I know but the story is really amazing. Anime um for anime it's a good up to a certain point. In the manga, I'm basically just saying it's better. But the anime is just, 
it's it's a it's a good thing to watch if you just want to see how it compares. This is this is the ending of my video. I just want to say thank you for watching this, and I'm sorry that my mind is not good with speaking. Um, again, this is Kira Bakora, and I would like to just say thank you. Bye.